This is the only neighborhood in town where exploded fireworks on the sidewalk outnumber the leaves. The amazing thing about On 15th video is the people who worked there who didn't judge you if you rented a copy of the rock movie The Rundown. I miss it every day. Sit and Spin is a really unique place of Seattle music history and I know I, I miss it a lot and a lot of people do even though it's been gone for over 10 years. The bar was right across here. The DJ booth was right over there, like in that little space. And this was the dance floor. It's crazy to me that I'm even talking this quietly in a space that used to be the most raucous, noisy, unbridled place. <laughs> to the Irish Wake for Lost Seattle Places. Tonight, we're here to remember all the fallen places. The first thing that hit you when you walked in the door was the smell. It was a place where artists, tech millionaires, and transients gathered as equals to tell stories, sing songs, and test flamethrowers. I launched the Ghost of Seattle Past Project in hopes that while these spaces may vanish, their memories would live on in stories and maps and an anthology of voices from every community in the city. We're trying to preserve as many memories as we can. See, there's nothing left. What happens when the stuff that characterizes the city is removed or replaced? If these places disappear, if we can't make our way back, where does it leave us? Nostalgia gets a bad rap, but the thing about nostalgia is that it's really productive. It helps us remember who we were, what a place was about, what we identified with here, where we became our best selves. The cafes and bookstores and underground venues, the bars and galleries and theaters and gay haunts, the restaurants, the stores, the buildings, the gathering spaces, and with ghosts, I want to leave something tangible behind that says, we were here and it mattered. This was our Seattle. We're very proud to announce that Chen Music Press is going to publish our anthology. Tonight, we will celebrate and mourn together. We will raise our glasses and our mics and our stories and our hearts and be one giant community. We will dance and sing and read and listen to one another. Tonight, we're throwing an Irish wake for lost Seattle.